Hello everybody, it's Chris again. Just want to show you some quick cards I made up the other night. I shouldn't say quick, they weren't that quick. Um, I took some 12 by 12 sheets of paper. I cut them at three and seven fifths long. And then I cut them by five and a quarter. So it's five and a quarter by three and seven fifths, three and three quarters. And then I had these embellishments that I got at a garage sale. So my goal was to use them up. So this is what I did with them. And the inside has made the hand of a friend always be near. And these are for the nursing home. So now I have to fold all these and sign and address them all. So they're all different, but similar. So they're all using this embellishment pack this ribbon and these um pearl drop things so like this one didn't have two this one had two top and bottom so they're all kind of the same and so they're you can see how they're stacking they're really thick so i would never mail these so these were definitely for the nursing home and there's some little uh enamel dots so this is what I made the other night and sorry, telephone ringing. So this is, they're all the same, but different, the same basic materials just laid out differently. Um, like these, this flower group was a little bit different than this flower group that was a little bit different than this flower group it was different from this one but they're all kind of the same and then there are let's see if i can find the giant ones so they're all a bunch like that and then there are a few that i had giant flowers so i just put them on and i trimmed off the edges this one I didn't trim off the edges and I just added a couple of pearl drops. So there's just a few of them that are giant and the rest have multiple small flowers. But they all have the same embellishment in the beginning and I'll have my bunny on the back. So that is the cards that I made for May. I still have to do April and March. And I did, I looked on Pinterest last night and luckily I didn't get down that rabbit hole too far, but I did find a couple of designs that I liked that I thought would be simple enough to whip up 50 cards pretty quick. So that's what I'm going to do is do that. And it's either using my heart punch punches to make shamrocks and then you put the three hearts together and it makes a shamrock or... If I have different shamrock or St. Patrick's papers, I can do strips going down them. So I'll show you those when I make those. But I have to get these done and then I can dive into my papers and see if I have stuff to make those. So I just want to say hello and this is what I did for me.